We're at Meyer Gardens and we are about to talk about the butterflies that are already opening up. You're going to be able to see them this weekend. I'm with Laurel Gott. Tell us a little bit about this year's display and what's different. So this year we're focusing on light and shadow. So it's a nice sunny day today. So lots of butterflies are emerging in our new observation station. Yeah, you're pretty excited about this, right? Because it gives more of a window for everybody to see what's going on. Absolutely. It was a custom made for us. Um, so there's more space in this emergence area, which is where we hang all the chrysalids and where they first emerge as adult butterflies. Do you have more butterflies this year? We order a lot every year, but um, usually we get about 7,000 that fly in the conservatory. Wow, okay, always a big weekend whenever they all come out, that's for sure. Yes. Um, and so what are some of the reasons why you love to do this particular display at Meyer Gardens? The Butterflies Are Blooming exhibition is really a herald of spring. It's everyone is like, spring's just around the corner, winter's been so long. And when you see butterflies flying around, you just automatically think spring. How long are you going to be able to see them? So we start getting shipments in mid-February, but the butterfly exhibition is March 1st through April 30th. And a lot of people wonder, like, what happens to the butterflies once they leave here? So butterflies adult, as adults only live for about two weeks. Um, so we stop getting shipments mid-April and they live out their natural life in the Tropical Conservatory. Yeah, which, I mean, obviously lots of food, lots of places for them to go. What are some of the favorite spots for the butterflies if you're coming to see it? Yeah, so thinking more about light and shadow, we set up feeding stations for them in the sun. And so they go right there and drink nectar that we make from honey and water. We also will set out rotten fruit that is more in the shadows that the butterflies like to sip kind of the juices off that as well. So it always is such an amazing thing and the kids come and they see it. And every year it is a little bit different, isn't it? It is, yep. And do you have any sort of particular butterflies this year that you're highlighting that are new? Um, we're kind of highlighting this year the butterflies that have iridescent scales on their wings. So like the common morpho that has the brown on the outside. But when they open their wings and the light hits it, it's the most beautiful color of blue. We have some emerald swallowtails and just the colors on them we're really looking at this year. All right. Well, it is such a great display and wonderful to be in here when it's warm uh, and beautiful as opposed to the cold and the snow outside. So thank you so much, Laurel, for letting us know what this display is going to be like. And if you're planning to head out this weekend, you're going to see the butterflies flying around. It's the perfect time for them. We've got more info information on our website at 13onyourside.com.